As we just said, in recent months, there has been a sharp drop in the number of Chinese tourists visiting Taiwan. Visitor statistics from the National Palace Museum show that in August of this year, compared to last year, there were 70,000 fewer visitors, a drop of 14 percent. The museum has suspended its expansion plans. It will wait until annual visitor numbers reach 7 million before we evaluate. Previously, there was a constant stream of tour buses delivering Chinese tourists to the National Palace Museum. Due to the freeze on Chinese visitors, the overall number of visitors this year was down by 5%. In August this year, for example, the total number of visitors to the museum was 396,054 people, compared to the same period last year of 465,433 people, this is 70,000 fewer. It is expected that visitor numbers in September may drop even further. The intended expansion plan has now been indefinitely postponed. National Palace Museum Director Lin Zheng Yi said originally they had expected annual visitors would reach 8 million and so budgeted 22.2 billion NT dollars to redevelop 7 hectares in the vicinity of the existing museum. However, due to environmental assessment disputes and protests by nearby residents, not having the budget in place and other factors the plans were halted. Now there are fewer tourists and the southern branch of the National Palace Museum is open. Visitors can be dispersed and the museum authorities will re-evaluate the need for an expansion project at the National Palace Museum.